Surely you mean the Bridgley School. That's what I said. Yeah. Right. That's the one. <sighs> Dean's new at school. That's why the academic office put us into a study group together. And you're the one who sells her marijuana? What? No, I told you I stopped smoking. I'm asking him. I should go. You're not going anywhere. I like to know who my daughter spends her time with. He got a gun! <laughs> chapter two. Well, book two, chapter four. Yeah, if y'all missed the last episode, I need y'all to go back and watch that. Every episode is action packed. Great character development, bruh. Let's go. Before I started going to the pool, I used to run. 5Ks, 10Ks, it didn't matter. Not how fast I sprinted, not whether it came in first. It was like trying to outrun my own shadow. But it's not my shadow I'm running from now. It's his. And he was running long before I was. I said turn off the engine! was a getaway bad news they did all that and it's a damn chopper on it, jay. who would have thought that jay was the best driver out of the whole family it makes sense though there on the left What the shit is the mom into? She way too accustomed to this type of... Barely see a thing out there. That's the idea. Cut the engine. Christ, I can't believe this. <sighs> We're alive. That's something, at least. You get that we're dumb for, right? We could still go to the cabin. How? On a magic carpet? Half the damn state's looking for us. And if anyone knows it's there... Cops will be halfway to Devil's Gulch before they realize they're not following us. The cabin's off-grid. Bear never told a soul about the place. We don't know that for sure. It's a huge risk. Well, Jesus, Tyler, we gotta go somewhere. Ooh, I mean, Mom seemed to be a little too seasoned for this lifestyle. We're gonna listen to Mom. Ma's right. The cabin's the safest place we got. Nobody asked you. Hey, don't talk to him like that. Look, you got away. Can you let me go now? Shut up. Rob the sheriff, bust to Mexico. Fuck, Ma. <sighs> All we do is cover up one mistake with the next one. We left Dale lying there. We just... We just left him. Why don't we talk in private? Keep an eye on him. Now I know none of this has gone like we planned. And what happened? Hey, oh, unlock the door. The what? No, I can't. Right Come now, on, man. This could be my only chance. If Tyler sees you, he won't if you hurry. Come on, please. Yeah, you gotta stand here, man. We got a plan. Yeah, I'm. I... The thing about the game is you take control of all the different characters, man. You gotta, you gotta stay in the car, bro. It's not a good time. I'm sorry, I can't.
I don't want him just running through the wood. Oh shit. Stop! And get yourself shot! Sock thing. Be giving you trouble? No. I took care of it. We're heading for the cabin. We'll be safe about it. Mm -hmm. Let's hit the highway before that chopper circles back. I didn't get any indicators that I uh I picked the um like a, a path. A permanent path. You sure so. Pa didn't tell anyone the cabin's there? Barely told me about it. I guess the motorcycle's there. And the food. See? Now you're looking on the bright side. <laughs> Nah. Nah. Jay's too good of a driver to go out like that. The door's stuck. I can't get them out. They're gonna die in there. Hey. You hear that? Go, go, go! Ain't no way. Hell. Vince? Come on. There it is. Right now. Just stay calm. I'm gonna get us out of here. Seatbelt's not gonna come out. Yep. Door's not working. Door's not working. Glove box. Do we have some scissors? Do we have anything? A knife? Come on. Anything in there, a screwdriver. That could work, that could work. Come on. All right, seatbelt off. We gotta be fast, we gotta be fast, come on. Wake up. Hey, you gotta wake up. Wait, you just got up like the Undertaker. No. Oh, he did? Oh, shit! Oh! Damn. You should have let him out. Shut up. Like you knew he was going to die in a car accident. Uh. <laughs> Ma! Tyler! Uh. Is he really dead though? Is Dale really dead though? Uh. That man in the ambulance. Hey, I think I saw someone run. <sighs> Jesus. Ten minutes in. <laughs> Quickly turning into Jay's story, huh? When an animal goes bad, all a man can do is put it down. Hey, let's go out to the cabin and get high. 
Where is it? Well, why can't I find it? The, the cabin. I, I think I need water. Somewhere at the edge of the world lies the lost fortress of awesomeness. All those who seek it have perished. All except one fearless young adventurer. His name, Ash Willema. Famed for his courage, his honor, and his, uh, his... Uh, strength. His almost superhuman strength. And this is the story of his quest. No! Okay. Joyce. Okay. Look, Shima. I drew the story about the fort. You know, the one Ryan saw in the forest? There are no forts in Arizona. He's making it up. No, it's true. He was out hiking with his dad, out by the ridge. There's a rock shaped like a shark's tooth. That's where they saw it. Mm-hmm. I was thinking, wouldn't it be awesome if we went looking for it too? We could camp out for the night and, uh, I don't know, do other cool stuff like, uh, like... Mm. We could take some rope and tie it to a tree and make a swing. It'd be amazing, just like Tarzan. Now, if you want to get outdoors, why don't you go ride your bike? And while you're at it, go get the mail. Besides, we can't this weekend because Because I... you're busy, like always. I bet my dad would have gone with me. You have no idea what kind of man your father turned out to be. All right. If you say so, whatever. I will whoop your low ass, man. Fuck you talking to like that. Hey, buddy, you be careful on that road now. It'll be dark soon and you ain't got lights. Go get the mail, Ash. this don't do it where are you going you running away you ain't got no peanut butter peanut butter and jelly you ain't got nothing you need dude i hope you ain't running away like that i hope he's going for a little stroll Thirty thousand feet Some piloting skills, and now the quest continues on foot. Huh. No, this this can't be right. Ah, oh, Mom. If you'd come with me, we could have found it by now. Somebody shooting, they hunting. How long have we been out here? Gotta be something I can eat. See? You should have brought that peanut butter and jelly, bro. To ash. 
to save that. I can wait. Definitely. Sure I can. Hello? What the hell is that? The bear. Oh shit, oh shit. Or pig, a, ha a hog. Oh crap. Be able to run. I'm not throwing my candy. There, there. Good piggy. Stay. Stay. I want to throw my candy. We defaulted to the run option anyway. Uh, uh, huh? Out by the ridge, near a rock shaped like a shark's tooth. No way. Get water? Gotta get warm. There you go. Alright, so I need to get water. Get some water. And Lucky! Water's running. Ah! I'd eat my own arm right now. Oh, man. You should have checked the expiration date first, bruh. Please let there be a medicine cabinet. How lucky can he get? Hurry it up! Probably want to clean that first. No, we didn't. We should have. I didn't. We gotta clean that first, bro. You don't just slap a band-aid on. You gotta clean the wound. I ain't. I ain't get a chance. What's the news? Hate to say it, but we've lost them in the woods. <sighs> Send out search parties. And notify local radio stations. I want everyone in the country knowing the name Holt. Roger that. <sighs> the Holts. Think we're gonna catch them? I'd say 50-50. The next 24 hours are critical. So it just depends on how smart they are. Why can't I look out the window? Okay. I should stay inside.
Anything else valuable? Family portrait. Okay, I'm not seeing any letter. Here we go. <clears throat> That's the woodman's cottage. It was my mom's, so don't drop it. Are you the one who found me? You're in pretty rough shape. You got babbling about some cabin or something. Are you lost? No. I, uh, I got hit by a car. Where? In the forest? On the highway? I must have hit my head and wondered. Oh. Wow. Well, maybe I should call 911. I'd drive you to the hospital, but I'm not supposed to use a car. No. My family, we can't afford medical bills. Well, don't you have insurance? I mean, yeah, but... You know how it is. They still make you pay more than you can. Well, I'm glad you're alive. I wasn't sure for a while there. Shit. Are you okay? Hell no! You went to Two Rock High, right? I, uh, yeah. The high school. I went for a while. Thought so. You used to eat lunch alone under that gnarly tree by the parking lot, right? The Juniper. Yeah, that was me. Tell me your name again. It's Dean. Hey, Dean. I'm Vanessa. Look, could I rest here a while? My head, it's... I'll stay out of the way, I promise. Hmm. Well, I guess I don't mind the company. But you have to be gone before eight, or my dad will kill us both. And just so we're clear, I once kicked a guy in the nuts so hard he swallowed his own tongue. <laughs> Good to know. Here. These are all, but they're clean. Thank you. <laughs> so, why'd you leave TRH? You got sick of Mrs. Campbell always sending everyone to detention? Nah. I dropped out. That makes two of us, by the way. I mean, technically I was pulled out so I could go to a lame Catholic school and be told what to wear and what to think, but... What was your excuse? Alright, I got used to the bathroom. I will be back. I didn't like being stuck inside all day. Well, what about Jim? They kept trying to teach me basketball. On that indoor court where the AC always breaks? Yeah. See? Much better. Baby, where's my sandwich? I'll be right there. Who was that? Oh, it's just my Mima. Are you hungry? You're going to behave yourself today, right, Mima? Hang on, I forgot my cigarettes. You haven't smoked in years. Haven't I? Nope. We have some new developments in what police are now calling the Desert Dream Massacre. We knew one of the shooters was killed at the scene, but it's been confirmed. Three more are still on the loose. You okay with ham and cheese? Oh, none of those disgusting sliced singles. The gunman who died was identified as Dale Holt of Two Rock, who had a prior conviction for assault. There's speculation the other suspects are members of the same family. Mima, we have a visitor. Um, hello there. That was risky. I know that voice. Huh? Oh, Lord Almighty, you're home. <laughs> Is it really you, Maddie? 
Yeah. It, yeah. It, oh shit. What should we do? Yeah or no? I. It's kind of funny though. I'm gonna be honest. Uh, hi, Mima. I missed you. Our face just My changed. My grandbaby. Where have you been all this time? Oh, I was, um... On an exchange program, living with another family. I know I liked you. Here, let me help. So, Matt, when you were with that other family, what did you do all day? I'm just curious, since you weren't at school and all. We was building homes and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Just do chores mostly. Take care of the yard. If my brothers, I mean, my friends, if they're home, maybe we go to the dump and find something we can fix, you know? <laughs> sure, <laughs> who doesn't chill at the dump? Matthew, you're gonna get an earful from your father being away from home for so long. Why would you even say that? Do you know how much hell your father's been through losing your mother? The two of you don't understand what it's like for him. Could you try not taking his side for once? <sighs> I'm gonna go listen to murder, she wrote. Welcome home, Maddie. She used to be my role model. She had a motorcycle license. She knew karate. Now she either can't find her pants or can't remember how to put them on. Matt. Matthew, he's your... My brother. <laughs> He died in a car accident. Damn. Shit. Don't ask what happened. I am they just. That sucks. I'm sorry. Well, I've had time to get used to it. Mima, she forgets. My brother died too. Kind of recent. How? He got shot. Fuck. That's, ugh, that's horrible. I know. We ain't even had time to grieve, bro. I study for a little bit? Finals start next week, and I haven't opened a book all semester. Can I help clean up? Be my guest. You know, you were smart to drop out. I mean, do we really need to know three ways Andrew Jackson changed the U.S. presidency? <sighs> Don't think so. If this comes up, I'm just going to skip it. really out here washing dishes bro so were you close huh to your brother yeah man he was always trying to protect me from things mm -hmm. from our older brother from pa when he was on a bender your dad he's a drunk or something was a drunk now he's Fighting for his life in a VA hospital. Damn, your luck's as bad as mine. What happened? I mean, we could be honest, shit. He hung himself. Or tried to. I stopped him. Jesus, Dean. This is a... Hey, is it, was it me or is her feet big as fuck? Nothing to say, but sometimes I wish my dad would die or whatever. Come on, you don't mean that. You'd understand if you knew him. He's a control freak. Yeah, see, yeah, see, that's, that's, that's that suburban shit. I forgot what year it is on here, but she must have been listening to that, that Eminem show or some shit, bruh. Come on. He can't be all that awful. Not in a nice house like this one. It's not that he's awful. He's just so uptight. Ugh. Anyway, sorry that got so dark. Hey, you want to help me study? Oh, I don't think I'll be much help. Uh, yeah, you will. 
That's always better with someone else. Okay. Sure. That better be talk about studying. Minnesota? Okay. <laughs> Wyoming? Her feet big than a Still bitch. No. Oh my god, I give up. It's Alaska. Over three million acres of parks, all protected. Only place with more is Canada. Let me see. Okay, your turn. What? No, I Which don't- Which president signed the 1906 uh... Landmark Antiquities Act, created the Forest Service, and established five national parks, including the Grand Canyon? Wait, I think I saw this on TV. Oh, man. Man, wait, first of all, 1905, what year was it? Man, shit. Thomas Jefferson? Nope, you're a hundred years too early. The correct answer is... I was gonna pick Roosevelt, but I, I ran out of time. Roosevelt. Oh. And I am officially gonna fail. So? You don't need some tests to know that you're... You're smart and... You know what? Never mind. Dean, that was, like, really sweet. <laughs> Shit, he's home early. I know why, Dean, that's a, that's, that's a rough name to have, school. man. Actually, no, see here? Ladies, Dean, Dean, ladies, like, that shit don't make sense. <laughs> the school part us up because... Hi, Dad. I thought you were working late. I didn't see another car out front. Who's this? Uh, this is Dean from school. Hello, Dean from school. Hello, sir. Well, I'm glad to see you studying. But remind me, Dean, which school do you go to? Man, why are you coming with that kind of ad? Oh, Lord. No man, it was a bridge away. Oh shit, guys. Uh, the Bridgeway School. He sipped on me. He sipped. Surely you mean the Bridgeley School. That's what I said. Yeah. Right. That's the one. <sighs> Dean's new at school. That's why the academic office put us into a study group together. And you, the one who sells her marijuana. What? No, I told you I stopped smoking. I'm asking him. I should go. You're not going anywhere. I like to know who my daughter spends her time with. He got a gun! He put the gun on the counter! Oh, that's gangster shit. Oh. You're a cop? I run a private security firm. His company guards banks. In a town that hasn't had a bank robbery in decades. Enough, Vanessa. Anyway, that might be changing. You hear about this motel massacre down on Route 66? No! Oh, right, on the radio earlier. Oh, feel me in? Yeah. What happened? Do you know? Apparently, three brothers botched a robbery and took over a motel. Things got pretty nasty. Well, is it over? Not quite. There's a manhunt underway. Once the FBI gets some sketches of this Holt family, their faces will be all over the country. Hey, son. Mm. I need your help with something. Don't you go anywhere. I am so, so sorry. I really think I should leave. No, you'll only make it worse. What do you mean? Vanessa, where's Mima's audio book? Hang on, it's probably in the bathroom. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Hey, get up out of here, man. I thought I told you to stay put. I thought he was talking to her. I. Somebody, you should have stayed still. Yeah, yeah, shut your motherfucking mouth. You're my dad, man. I'll do respect, sir. 
I don't gotta do what you say. Under my roof, you do, smart Alec. Dad, have you checked her? <laughs> What's going on? Your study partner was sneaking out. Uh, you weren't even gonna say goodbye? Oh shit. Well, I suppose I have no right to keep you here. Thank you, sir. My mom will be... Hang on. Why are you wearing my son's clothes? I can explain. Well, he got a gun. I don't know if he took his gun. It's on the counter. I right, look. Look, I got struck by a car earlier. Vanessa found me and cleaned me up. A hit and run? You kids should have called the cops. We could just flag down the one that's been patrolling. No. It was my fault. I forgot to look. I was high. Are you kidding me? Get the hell out of my house. That's what I was trying to do. Goddamn junkie. I, your, your daughter the one that smoked weed and all that. You. Talk like she better than me. Call me a junkie over some weed. Now what happens? Chase, you in there? I don't. <laughs> Only two options we got. I mean, I got a 50-50 chance of picking the right wall, 33% chance because there's three spots. Wake up and hang these bush tails in the pantry for me. Damn it, I'll do it myself. Pussies, with your threatening letters. What's the matter? Can't face me like men? Well, I ain't got your ten grand. So if you want it, go well, fuck yourself. I must miss the QTE, bro. I forget that those are even a thing. Okay. Here's how we get out of this hole. Come Take on. what's left. Come on. Bye, Brent. Find a high stakes game. Son of a bitch! You tell anybody about this place, I'll find you and skin you alive, you little rat. He shot in the air, he ain't shoot at me. Huh. Yes, yes, a road. Wasn't my fault. I can't be responsible for that shit. Yo, Life is Strange 3. It was 3 or 4. Anyway, I don't know if y'all seen that trailer, but Max is coming back from the original game. I'm excited. Ah! Uh, don't be broken. Don't be broken. Please don't be. Ah! Mom. Mom. I'm sorry, I should have come straight home. That's what happens. You little badass little kid. Yeah, listen, look at you now. Your leg is green and purple. Uh. 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 Adventure camp? Hope you and your boy have a great trip, Miss Willemma. He's gonna be so surprised. That's today. Oh, Mom.
I got half the sheriff's department looking for you. Tell my mom. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now hold on. You tell her yourself. You okay? <laughs> Jesus, what happened to you? I was... <laughs> I was looking for the fort. Ash, what are you talking about? What happened to you out there? I... I couldn't find it. I fell. Got lost. That's all. <laughs> Ash? 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 Easy, easy. Hey, I got you. We're gonna get you to a hospital. Okay. I guess his voice reminds me of one of the people from the movie Blue Street. I wonder if he could have died. I know this is a flashback, but I wonder if we'd have messed up the QTEs if he'd have died. Two months later, so we know there's a cabin here. There it is. Lucky to get over the highway, much less the border. They'd be looking everywhere. Well, you got a better plan? Because I don't. Jay! Oh, God. I thought I lost you. You should have said, you should have told them, alerted yourself where you walked in. You could have got your head blown off, young man. Any cops? I thought they got you, Ma. I was so scared. I'm fine, darling. Nothing a couple of aspirin won't fix. Are you okay? Better now. What were you thinking? Sneaking up on us like that. Were you followed? See? I know how to cover my tracks. You got some kind of plan? Beginnings of one. Dante's got an account number in that little black book. If it's what I think it is, That's then... for later. First, we need to get to Canada. Canada? Cops are gonna be all over the southern border, so we head north. You hate the cold. Don't worry, Jay. I got your back. You know that, right? I got yours too. You're my brother. Good. I'm gonna take first watch. You two get some rest. We got a long day tomorrow. They all gonna die. They all gonna die, baby. Whole family. Oh, you sleep longer. I was tuning up the bike. Can we talk about this Canada thing? We're not going to Canada. We're going to Texas. Huh? I know a guy in Eagle Pass who can get us across the Grand. So, why'd you tell Jay North? Because he ain't coming. What? First thing tomorrow, I'll send him to Canab. Say he's our scout. By the time he gets back, we'll be long gone. No, I am not doing that to him. Ain't it bad enough we lost Dale? Hey, you think I want this? That I want any of it? <sighs> we both know Jay was never exactly your favorite. But I still looked out for him, didn't I? All I've ever done, I did for this family. Work my butt. Hey, come on, man. Sound like Walter White. Shut your ass up. My bad. But off since I was 14. Been protecting you from Pa from when I was old enough to hit him back. Hell, I barely even had a life of my own. I was so busy dealing with everyone else's. For 25 years, it's always been me. Who takes it on the chin? Tyler, the eldest. The responsible one. Well, enough's enough, Ma. I ain't going down with the ship. There's two seats on that motorcycle, not three. And Jay ain't getting one. And fuck you, man. What are you doing? You don't think I heard Even. you? Uh, this is crazy. I'll stay, you two go. You'll never survive out here alone, but Jay will. 
He practically lives in these woods. I don't care. I'll die here if I have to. Nuh-uh. We're all gonna make it because Jay's gonna do the right thing and stay. I ain't got no options. Hell no, nah, you stay. You be the one. I don't want to be alone. Oh, come on. You love being alone. Get your hands off me! You're running off alone ever since you learned to walk. Get off! Besides, you owe us. Owe you? You heard me. You're the one who stole that goddamn book. I didn't know. Exactly. Because you're always in your own goddamn world. Pa. He treated you like you were some golden boy. But you've been lost in your daydream since the day we took you in. What? Your real mom should have done us a favor. Tyler. What the fuck? That explains so much. I don't like Tyler now. Grab that gun and get up. Hit him with the juice, man. Turn into Bishop. Enough. What do you mean? My real mom? Mama? What's he talking about? <sighs> you are blood, and I raised you as a son. So that makes me your mother. The rest doesn't matter. Like hell it don't. Me and the audience want to know. What matters now? It matters to me. Spit it out. Who is my real mom? My younger sister, Brooke. She died giving birth to you. You had a sister? Who is my father? You don't have one. Yeah, yo, whoop his ass. I'm tired of him. Should have been Dale. Should have been. I knew that was coming. I'm leaving. You better hope I don't get caught. Jay, please. Let's talk about this. Tyler, what are you doing? He knows the whole goddamn plan. Jay! Don't you dare hurt him! Yo. Jay! Get back here! I'm not ready! You said I know these woods, right? Better than anybody. Why would you be out here? In my environment trying to get me. I do this shit. Look, forget what I said, okay? Nah. Of course I'm your brother. I don't trust him. I used to change your diapers. I know you once tried to keep a squirrel as a pet. And that you hate Ma's baked potatoes. Nah. I don't want to hurt you, Jay. I just need to know you're not going to tell anyone the plan. Don't push me, Tyler. You're not my brother anymore. Come on now. You're just being dramatic. I'll shoot you if I have to. I don't want to, but if you make me... Oh! <laughs> Fighting over the gun, he ain't gonna make it. He ain't gonna make it. He's done. You have to shoot him. Get down here, Jay. I swear to fucking God. It's the Hunger Games now. Can't take a fall. Mm, mm, mm. And with that, see y'all in the next one.